Alright, hi everyone, it's Taser back again here at Vitamax Rehab and Wellness. Today, we're going to take the time to talk about something called a Trendelenburg Gate. And a Trendelenburg Gate looks like this. Now, with a Trendelenburg Gate, what ends up happening is that the person starts to manifest in weakness of the butt muscle that comes on the outside of the hip, the gluteus medius specifically. And that causes that abnormality that you just saw in that video. So we're going to take the time today to go over three exercises that are going to help rectify that problem and ensure that the gait is back to normal. Now the first exercise you're going to do lying down on your side. And when you're lying down you want your affected hip or the hip with the weakness facing up. You're going to straighten out your legs, keep your pelvis facing forward. And what you're going to do is simply start raising up your leg. Now be careful not to raise it up too high, such that your pelvis starts to turn backwards. You want to do this for about 3 sets of 10 reps, and repeat that every other day. There should be no pain, just a feeling of your side butt muscle working. Now the second exercise is equally as simple. When you're in the side lying position, what you'll do is you'll bend your knees up to a point where they create a 90 degree angle. Once you're in this position, the goal is simple. You're gonna be opening up your legs, but keeping your heels and feet together. All right, so we're gonna open up facing forward as high as you can without tilting your hip. Hold that up there for two seconds and then bring it back down. Now for me, it's very limited. You may be able to take it a bit higher, Repeat that for about 3 sets of 10 reps every other day as well. And we're looking for that feeling of weakness and soreness in the muscle, but no pain. Now the last exercise is a glute kickback and only do this if you don't have knee problems because we're going to be bearing a lot of weight on the knees here. What you'll do is you're going to get in a figure four position or a tabletop position, comfortably so. You want to make sure that your spine is in neutral, not bent or extended, just a neutral position. And the exercise is very simple. You want to lift up the affected side as high as you can and bring it back down. And repeat that again, three sets of 10 reps every other day. If you're having issues with balance, then by all means, avoid doing this exercise. And make sure when you're doing it at home that you're not doing it on an elevated surface like I am here. Make sure you're doing it on the floor for safety reasons. All right, once again, my name is Taser, resident physiotherapist here at Vitamax Rehab and Wellness. If you have Trendelenburg gait, this could be a pretty prominent solution for your problem. But if your pain persists or it's just not getting fixed at home, then I ask you to do two things. One, see your doctor, have a discussion with them about what could possibly be going wrong. And two, stop by a clinic where we can do a comprehensive assessment, set you up with the right exercises and make sure that this is no longer a problem.